hide. I don't know if I can do this. I'm shaky. Forgive me. I wanted to hop on and just let you know I haven't forgotten about you all. There's lots of stuff to be done. Uh, I, if you follow my Twitter, I got up night before last to go to the bathroom and something in my back popped. I have been in Ouchieville ever since. I will be okay. I've made it through worse than this. I just wanted to hop on and let you know that right now, <laughs> I can't do a whole lot of standing. I'm in some pretty good amount of pain. But I also wanted to just come by and encourage you a little bit. Give me just a second if I can reach this. I didn't think about this until after I started this. Wanted to encourage you just a little bit. I'm crazy with the camera. I'm sorry. Y'all just have to bear with me. Um, just wanted to hop on and give you, and I know it's very shaky. I'm, I'm really sorry. I'm trying to maintain, um, just maintain because, yeah. And I'm in my gown, and I know that's not a flattering thing. And I try to keep the camera up higher because, you know, there's some things you just don't need to see. And that's one of them. Wanted to share a good word with you today. I have not done that this week, and I don't want it to go too many days before I do. So we're going to pull something out of our little my little box of Psalms. Um, it's 101 Treasured Prophecy. A prop promises I can't speak well today um, medicine will be kicking in at any point in time because I just took it a while ago my husband came in earlier from work um, and thankfully he's got he could take a half a day and take in so I could get some relief <coughs> or EJ um, but we're reading from a box of blessings and this is one of my favorite psalms. Um, it is uh, Psalm 121, 1 and 2. And it says, I will lift up mine eye, my eyes to the hills from whence come my help. My help comes from the Lord. And I just want to take a moment and encourage you. Um, I know during this time, while we're all having lots more um time to do a whole lot of things that maybe we need to needed to you know those all those things that we've been waiting for time yeah we can you know we can get those done now um i'm just gonna show you yeah it's real here um i need my hair and and to be honest with you i'm thinking about just letting the gray grow I'm thinking seriously about just embracing it and going with it. But, yeah, that's my world, and I'm sorry I can't quite, yeah, we'll do this. I'm trying to keep it as steady as I can, and I'm, I apologize for being so shaky. It just is, I guess, whatever the spasm doohickey thing in my back, because it's a hard knot, and it's ouchy. Um, but it's like... <sighs> It, it's just like almost rendered me useless. Um, but anyway, um, you know, I, I can get up and do a few things, but it's just, I'm, I'm trying to get up more today than I did yesterday because laying around is just not good. Um, but anyway, um, during this time, those things that you needed to get done, it's a good time to get them done. Um, there's a lot of things that I'm seeing that I just don't like. And it's not my circus, nor my monkeys. So, I'm staying out of it. I will say that over the weekend, that somebody that is a more, that has a more, more of an influence uh, not on YouTube, um, more, I'd, more so on Twitter, decided to, excuse me, my nose is itchy, decided to 
retweet one of my tweets and make me an example with that. And I'm certain that it had more to do with the fact that I go by the mayor's daughter than anything else. Um, tried to make something political that I didn't make, that I didn't intend to be made political. Um, and I'll just tell you, if your church is having drive-in church, great. If your church is having online church, great. If your church is choosing to do something different, I may have to disagree with you. Um, however, whether we agree or not doesn't change the fact that I love you and appreciate you and pray for you. Um, the There are some things that have happened in the state of Kentucky um, that are oversteps and um, that we'll just leave that where that is. And I'm sure that you already have heard, you know, the KSP was at one of the churches writing down license plate numbers and issuing stuff like that. That's all well and good, so to speak, in the grand scheme of things, except for nobody addressed the fact that the parking lot from end to end was filled with nails. So somebody had to go somewhere to get those nails because not very many people just keep a parking lot full of nails laying around. You understand what I'm saying? Anywho, that's all I'm going to do with that. Again, I want y'all to be encouraged. Um, pray for our nation. Pray for our leaders. I said this before. If if you're in a leadership position, you know we hold you up in prayer. Um, and to, and if you're a parent, you're in a leadership position. If you're um, raising a child, you're in a leadership position. Um, if you are, you know, of course, the obvious leadership positions, you're in a leadership position. So anyway, yeah. And thank you very much. Um, just wanted to hot stop in and tell you, I don't know how this, how the rest of this week is going to go. I got, I have plans. The plans, stuff needs to go in the garden, but I can't bend down there to get it there. So we're kind of like in a holding pattern. So anyway, that's all I got for you today. Um, be safe, stay home, um, use common sense, common courtesy, um, be kind to each other. Now's the time to pull together, not apart. I love you oh so much. And remember, I am the mayor's daughter. Y'all have a great day. I'll see you. Bye.